Last time on Pokemon Fire Red. Oh! Level 31! Wow! This thing is probably gonna sweep my team. Oh! Except it can fly, because I know it has Dig Mud Slap. Let's see. And Santa. Oh! If its last move is ground, it can fly, won't be affected at all. Okay. Oh, of course. That's just Murphy's Law right there. Oh, 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 come on, no! Not, oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Here I go, all cheeky. Oh, yeah, it can fly, won't be affected at all. Of course, now it gets swept. Ugh. Uh oh. Good. It doesn't do too much. Oh, come on, how many? You were get. Ugh. How lucky can you get with Fury Swipes two times in a row? Okay. You get lucky with a Mud Slap once in a while as well. Oh, uh, let's just... Oh, I can't run. Guess I'm gonna have to find out how fast that thing really is. Can't be that fast. Start chucking our Pokeballs, hoping to catch it. Ah. Uh. Yeah, to catch it, I don't know if I'll explain this yet. It has to shake four times. Um, I was originally planning on using a Diglett slash Dugtrio on my team, but I decided against it at the last moment for, um, oh, oh, yay. Not that I'll be using it, but I can always keep it on my party as backup in case I run into trouble, because i <laughs> level 31 at this point in the game. I'm pretty sure that's good for any team. I'll meet you guys back. Okay. Um... Yeah, we'll be covering this route in just a minute. Anyway, fun fact, yeah, I left out, um, the trio for the man. The last second. Oh, man. Where am I going? Anyways, it can't be this, that fast. How, how fast is this thing? <gasps> oh my god! 83 speed? Wow! Okay, that's really fast. I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, guys. I basically just went in and healed up my Pokemon. Um, nothing too big. But look at this Dugtrio. I mean, 62 HP. 83 speed. I mean, look at the man. Charmeleon. They have 63 and 64 HP. I mean, that's HP really low. Oh, well. Take the good with the bad. You outspeed everything, but you can't take hits. Anyway, let's go take on Route 11. The Route with the epic music. Anyway, this route has a ton of battles, and I mean a ton. Um, they'll probably be times four speeded instead of times two, just because of the sheer amount of them. I'll see you guys later. Okay, guys, I went and uh, healed up just because I was paralyzed, and I might as well have. I'm going to do something that people have been begging me for for a while. Yes. You saw right. Yes, our Nido Rhino evolved into the Almighty Nido King. Nido King is crazy. Ooh, Thrash. Yes, definitely. That's a nice little quinky dink. Horn attack and uh, Thrash in one level. I'm gonna get rid of Peck because I have Charmander or Charmeleon to get rid of those bugs. Oh well. Yeah, that should make it really, really strong. Cause. Needle King is a beast. Gets a ground subtype, which will help in the next gym. Hint, hint. Yeah, its defense isn't that great, but other than that, it's really balanced. 
so that's what I like about it. Okay, guys, I'll meet you back down on Route 11. Okay, guys, we might as well start battling, because might as well at some point. Um, I'm going to talk through these first few battles, and then I have some really bad music to go along. Yeah, these are sped up by times four. Um, basically, it's just the abundance of battles on this route. I had to, otherwise it would be about 15 minutes. Um, so yeah, this guy isn't that hard, just two horsies. What's this? It can fly, it's evolving! Yes, two evolutions in one video. You guys are all gonna thank me for that, aren't you? Yes, it can fly, it's now evolved into Golbat. It's still not in its final evolution. Yes, you can get Crobat in this game. Um, will it learn anything? No. Oh, well. It's still pretty damn good. Let's take a look at it, actually. Should have strengthened up a bit. Yeah, it's special attack, but I knew that right from the start. Doesn't? It's not a good special attacker. Anyway, guys, I'm going to put music to the next few battles. Because of all your requests, um, I couldn't get any of them, so I had to improvise. See you guys at the end of this route. Experience to the next level, come on. Okay guys, now that we're finally done that route, well we're not quite yet, you can grab an escape rope on that rock, come over here and you'll grab a great ball, that's actually pretty great, sorry, that was bad, uh, rudely interrupted by a uh, drowsy, anyway, if you're aiming to reach Lavender Town, take rock tunnel, no, although you have to, anyway, come up these stairs, Hi, remember me? I'm one of Professor Oak's aides. If you have 30 species, he'll give you an item finder, which is quite useful for those underground paths. When I get it, I'll make a video of the underground paths. I don't have it yet. This guy will offer a neat arena for a neat rhino. I'm perfectly happy with my Needle King. And let's try to come out this way. 
Oh, no. Snorlax. Wake up. Quite honestly, it should be able to. That's a Chestoberry. Anyway. We've got the uh, binoculars. See what the binoculars. To get to Lavender Town, Rock Tunnel appears to be a good path. It's like hints. Big Pokemon sleeping on the road. Gee, thanks. Haven't noticed that. Anyway, guys. Um. I've been saying that way too much this video. Okay, guys. Anyway, guys. I'll try to break that habit next video. So next time, we'll be taking on the SSN. See you guys then.